Hi, in today's video, I will be taking you through tutorials which will help you understand how to export data. Indicab lets you export duties, receipts, customer invoices, payment gateway, purchase duties, purchase invoices, purchase payment and vehicle fuel transactions. This video will show you how to use this functionality. First we look at exporting duties. To export duties you need to go to duties all. Now click on the large gear icon next to add booking, click on export. The filter section on the top lets you filter specific duties based on name, number, city, duty type or booking ID. For example, if you wish to export all your duties completed by a customer for the month of January, select Dorian Steel in the filter section and next to the filter section is the date range that will let you export duties between specific date ranges. This pop-up window will let you select all the columns you would be requiring for the MIS report. For example, you wish to export details of this customer with regards to driver allowances etc. You have to simply select the required columns from the pop-up. Once you have selected the columns, you can simply click on save as new. This will ensure that you are able to use the same set of columns in future as well without spending time selecting them again. Once this is done, you have an option to either save the PDF format by clicking on download statement or you can simply export your file by clicking on export. Now we are going to look at export invoices. With Indicap, you can create outstanding statements sales reports, GST reports, etc. from the export invoice section. To do that, you need to go to operations billing. Click on the large gear icon next to add invoice button. Select export invoices. This pop-up has slight differences. You can select the date range as explained earlier. Also, you have an option to export paid, unpaid or both invoices. Let's look at exporting receipts. You can now export your payment receipts using Indicab. To do that, you need to go to Operations Receipt. Click on the large gear icon next to Add New Receipt button at the top. The pop-up that appears lets you export your invoice payment receipt, on-account receipt and advance receipt. Similar to the previous exports, you have to select the set of columns and save it for future use. You can set the required date range and click on export. Let's look at payment gateway section. Go to operations, payment gateway. With Indicab, you can now export your payment requests. To do that, click on the large gear icon next to new payment requests. Select the date range, columns and click on export. Indicab lets you export data at supplier level. To export duties completed by your supplier, you need to simply go to Operations Purchase Duties. Go to Large Gear icon at the top right side of the screen and click on Export. The pop-up is similar to the pop-up that you see in the Export Duties section. You need to select the relevant fields and click on Export or you can click on Download Statement option and get a PDF copy. To export invoices generated against your supplier invoice, you need to go to Operations purchase invoices. Now click on the large gear icon next to the add purchase invoice tab and select export. This pop-up is similar to the pop-up you see while exporting customer invoice. Just like the customer invoice pop-up you have an option to either export paid, unpaid or both invoices. You have a similar option to select the date range and then you have a list of columns which you can select and save for future. We now be looking at purchase payment section. In this section, Indicab lets you export the payment records and receipts for your supplier. Just click on the large gear icon next to the add payment and select export. This pop-up will let you select the date range and columns you need to export. Once you are done selecting the columns, you can simply click on export. Operations vehicle fuel. Go to the large gear icon next to the add fuel transaction and click on export. Select the date range, the columns you need and then click on export. I hope you liked the video. If you have any questions, you can either mention them in the comment section 
or you can call us on our support number which is mentioned in the description. You can also write to us at support at the rate indicap.com.